Welcome everyone. My name is Joelle and this is a short yin yoga practice that is perfect for the morning if you don't have a lot of time but still want to get a nice deep stretch and a rush of positive energy to start out your day. Let's begin lying down on our stomachs and then open out your right leg to the side so that the right shin is roughly parallel to your mat. You can rest the forehead to the back of the hands. And if you would like to add on, you can begin to bend that left knee, perhaps catching hold of the left foot with your right hand. Take a few moments here to make the posture your own. That might be turning your head to the side if that's more comfortable. Close the eyes and begin to inhale deeply in and out through the nose. Yin yoga is one of my favorite things to do in the morning and it can be really nice to start the day out with an affirmation as well something to carry you through the day, remind you of everything that it holds, everything to look forward to. My affirmation for today is, today I will be present. And you're welcome to use the same one if that resonates for you or choose your own. Very slowly, if you were holding that foot, release it. Pull the right leg back alongside the left and we'll simply switch sides. So once you're ready, opening up that left knee out to the side, feeling the stretch along the inner thigh and the groin. Maybe adding on by bending the right knee and taking hold of that foot with your left hand and you could turn your head again towards the left or leave the forehead on the back of the right hand or forearm. And this might be a very different experience on this second side. In yin yoga these differences are always worth observing acknowledging and being grateful for the fact that we have two sides and the fact that we can take a few moments here to release, to open and to be at peace. And just like before, if you had that foot, you can gently let it go. Bringing left leg alongside right. And we'll simply turn over onto our backs. Letting the sole of the left foot find the mat. And crossing your right ankle over your left knee or a supine pigeon or a sleeping swan pose, perhaps leaving the sole of that foot on the mat, 
or else catching hold behind your left thigh or front of the shin to encourage the legs in closer towards the chest. A very deep stretch for the hips here. Again, just allow the stretch to be what it is. Continue to encourage that right knee to open up. Close the eyes once more if you haven't already. And just breathe into any sensations that come up for you. And let's take one last little squeeze here before releasing your legs, uncrossing that ankle and just moving over to the second side, left ankle over right knee, maybe staying here, pressing that knee open or else bringing the legs in towards the body, holding on wherever is appropriate for you today. Observing again the differences between one side and another. And reminding ourselves perhaps here, today I will be present. One final squeeze before letting those legs go, bringing both feet to the mat and rolling to one side to make our way up to a seated position, taking your time to get there. And once you've arrived, extend the left leg out at a diagonal, bringing the sole of the right foot towards your inner left thigh so that you can release down onto the right palm or perhaps right forearm. And you might just stay there or you might like to add on by reaching the left arm up and over the head. And we can just kind of hang out in space if that's what you're doing or you can softly rest the palm behind the head. Again, taking just a few deep breaths to Find the variation of the pose that is right for you before settling in and holding. And pressing into the right palm, lift your way back up. We'll keep the legs exactly as they are, but this time face the upper body down your extended leg. Maybe sitting up tall, or perhaps tiptoeing the fingertips forwards into a forward fold. And a reminder that in yin yoga, we are not pushing or forcing or pulling. So there is no need to grab or hold on to anything. Just let the upper body be heavy with the weight of that head. 
sink the chin towards the chest. And maybe gradually over time, the upper body will naturally find its way a little bit closer to that leg. Allow everything to be as it is, as we hold and breathe. And once again, begin to press the palms into the mat so that you can straighten back up. And one last pose here with the legs in this position. Begin to twist yourself over towards the right. A gentle twist, so you might simply rest the left hand on top of the right knee. Again, without any forcing or pulling. You can look over the right shoulder or keep the head straight. A few moments here in this gentle seated twist. Wonderful. Bringing yourself back to center with the upper body, crossing the legs, and we'll take things to the other side for that half butterfly by extending through the right leg, sole of the left foot towards that inner thigh, and releasing down onto your left palm or forearm choosing whether you may like to reach the right arm up and overhead, just letting it dangle in space, observing where you feel sensation in this posture, finding about two thirds of your maximum stretch, so feeling a little bit of discomfort is all right in yin yoga, but never pushing towards any pain. And once you have found that place, allow yourself to be still. Appreciate this moment. Appreciate yourself for showing up and appreciate your body for everything that it can do. And then pressing that hand against the mat to straighten up, turning towards your extended leg to again sit up tall or perhaps folding over any amount. Maybe even turning the palms up to avoid any temptation of pulling. Let yourself just hang heavy here, no tension. Stay with your breath. Stay with the pose. And be present.
And very slowly begin to inch that upper body back up, keeping the legs as they are, and a gentle twist now over towards the left, perhaps with both hands up on fingertips or right hand resting on left knee. Finding a space here where you can remain and breathe. Gently bringing yourself back towards center. Bring that right leg back in, cross it in front of the left, roll the shoulders back a few times. Maybe shake out the neck or find any little wiggles that feel nice. Getting ready for a wonderful day in front of you. And all together, let's inhale the hands up towards the sky and exhale them down to heart center. Thank you so much for joining me today in beautiful Colorado. I do have several other short yin yoga practices on my channel, which I will link to below. And I hope to practice with you again very soon. Please do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And you go enjoy that beautiful day.